to pay respect to the Buddha, let's recite Namo Tassa three times. Namo Tassa Bhagavato Arahato Sama Sambodasa Namo Tassa Bhagavato Arahato Sama Sambodasa Namo Tassa Bhagavato Arahato Sama Sambodasa <coughs> The day we will teach Dwara Sangaha, Dwara Doors, the compendium of doors. One chart is a vital process, after that a mind or process. So uh, later we will teach uh, those uh, process, uh, so now we will jump. So the third chart is a Chakudwara. Chakudwara is a Aindo. Uh, <coughs> Chaita is a 46. Uh, I think uh, now we should not try to know 46. Only I want to teach what is uh, Chakudwara, what is Aindo. Aindo is eye sensitivity into the eye. That is what uh, we call Aindo. And Iyado, Sodadwara, Iyado. Iyado is uh, ear sensitivity into the ear, one kind of rupa. That is uh, Iyado. Why we call Do? Do is uh, usually people come, come in, come out. So in the same way, uh, from our eye ear, the object come in, come out. Or the mind come in, come out. So because of this uh, uh, eye, eye sensitivity, ear sensitivity, it is those are uh, like a door. Because of this, uh, we call uh, door. Doors. Next one is a Ghana Dwara, nose door. Nose door is a nose sensitivity into the nose, one kind of rupa. Uh, Jainwa Dwara, dang door. Dang door is a dang sensitivity or dang translucency in the dang. Kaya Dwara, body door. Body door is a body sensitivity or body translucency in the body. Manodwara, mind door. Uh, mind door is uh, the last sleeping mind. Uh, when cognitive uh, mind arise, sleeping mind stop. So the last sleeping mind, last boinga is uh, we call mind door. Mind door, what is a mind door? Mind door is a boinga mind or sleeping mind. Uh, because a new object come from uh, that uh, Bowenga. <coughs> Dwara Vimoda, door free. Uh, door free is uh, 19 Nambadi Sandi Bowenga Chuti. Uh, those are called door free. Why we call door free? Nambadi Sandi is uh, the beginning point of life. Uh, so, Nambadi uh, Sandi is uh, it itself uh, is. Uh, Door. Uh, Buddhist is a one kind of mind door. So they not come from the door. Uh, at that time, there is no door. The very beginning point. So uh, we call the door free. Uh, Boinga is uh, it itself uh, is a uh, mind door. So not coming from the door. Originally, he is uh, himself a door. Chuti is uh, the last one, 
that is also we call you not know, coming in front door. Uh, uh, they are also like uh, uh, it itself. Uh, they are doors. Because of this, uh, these are we call door free. Actually, body sandy bonga chuti is uh, the same type. Uh, bonga and chuti bonga and body sandy though are the same type. Because of beginning and point, we say body sandy relinking. Because of the ending and point, we call bowinga chuti. Uh, chuti. <coughs> so uh, only you need to know what is eye door, ear door, nose door, tongue door, body door, mind door. Uh, now I think that is enough. Next one is aramana sangaha, compendium of objects. What is the objects? Six objects. Rupa Ramana, Kala objects. What is that? That is a Kala, one kind of Rupa. In Bali, we call Vona. Sada Ramana, sound object. What is a sound object? Sound, one kind of Rupa. Ganda Ramana is a smell object. Uh, that is a smell. That is a one kind of rupa. Rasa ramna, taste. And when you eat, eat uh, you can feel a taste. And that is also one kind of rupa. And these, these rupas are objects. Object. And the mind can take uh, those objects. Next one is a put up ramna, tangible object. Uh, tangible object is uh, something uh, you can touch. So. Uh, what is a tangible object? Are the element, fire element, wind element? These are three elements uh, we call tangible object. If you touch something, maybe earth, maybe fire, maybe wind. What is a strong? For example, you touch uh, hot water, uh, you may you can feel hot. That is a fire. Uh, some uh, from the pan, the wind blow you, you know that, so that is a wind. So if you touch on the ground, other element is more obvious. So these three are tangible objects. Dhamma, Ramana, Dhamma object. Dhamma object is uh, all other objects, except previous five or previous seven. Uh, so 21 rupa, uh, originally 28 rupa, but uh, minus uh, 7 above, so only 21. Check that, 89, 89 or 121. Check the sika, 52. Nibbana, Nibbana is a Nibbana. Uh, <coughs> timeless. Uh, for the Nibbana, we cannot say present, future, pre uh, past. So timeless, Panyati, uh, concept or conventional, that is also timeless. Timeless is a uh, cannot say past, present, future. Uh, so because of just a concept, just a name, uh, name is another, because of another, uh, cannot say past, present, future. <coughs> So now, do and aramana. Uh, in the eye door, rupa ramana appear. That is also present only. Whether you are eye, you cannot see past kala. <laughs> past kala, you cannot see. Present kala only, whether you are eye, can see. So in the eye door, uh, rupa ramana present appear. Uh, so Iyado, Sadaramna, that is also present sound only we can hear. Past sound we cannot hear with ear. With the mind you may hear, you may hear, but uh, with the ear you cannot hear the sound uh, which is uh, past. So, Kanda, Nozado, Nozado and Kandaramna, 
they are together appear. Tang Jo and Rasa Ramana. Rasa Ramana also present. You are Tang cannot taste previous uh, taste. <laughs> whether you are Tang, only with but uh, whether you are mine can miss uh, the food uh, which uh, uh, you have experienced. So next uh, body do body do and put up Ramana. With the body, we touch tangible object. Yeah. So mind door, mind door, and all six aramnas. Uh, so mind door, in the mind door, you should know all six aramna, six objects can be uh, in mind door. So with the mind, you can, you can think gala, uh, you can think sound, you can hear sound, you can get a smell with the mind. Uh, taste also with the mind uh, you can feel. Uh, tangible object also with the mind uh, you can get. The other object also with the mind. So in the mind door, all objects uh, can appear in the mind door. <coughs> Even present, past, future, timeless, uh, accordingly is uh, according to books I write, uh, many details uh, have. Many details have. So here, uh, just uh, briefly only, uh, briefly only. So, Dwara Vimota, Dorfried. Dorfried was a British and Bowengachuti. All six are not possible. For the British and for the Bowenga, for the Chuti. So, here, according to this table, only you need to know uh, who, what are aramanas, what are objects, what are doors, only need to know. Uh, other 46, uh, that is a uh, may not need uh, now, later I will teach. Next one is a word to sing, uh, compendium of bases. Check what to I'm base. Base mean is the place of mind. Which mind? To unconsciousness. To unconsciousness arises uh, on the I'm base. So sort out to ear base. Ear base is ear sensitivity. The same. Before we use it as a door, now we use it as a base. Can say as a door because uh, uh, the mind come in, come out. Because of this, uh, uh, insensitivity are doors. Yeah. So now we use as a base. When we say base, these two consciousness arise on the iron base. Because of this, uh, sometimes we use a base, sometimes we use a door. Yeah. <coughs> so the Ghana would nose base. Nose base is a nose sensitivity one kind of materiality. Which consciousness arises on that base? Two knows consciousness. One is a result of Kusala, one is a result of Kusala. Now we have learned in the, in the Jaita section. Next one is a Jainwa Watu Dang base. The same, Kaya Watu body base. Body base is a body sensitivity, one kind of rupa. Yeah. Which mind arise on that? Two body consciousnesses, consciousnesses arise on the body base. Heart and yeah, what to? Heart base. Remaining in 75. Remaining in 75, consciousness arise on the heart base. So most of mind arise on the heart base. Without base, for arupa vipaka. Uh, because uh, in Aruba realm, no, no have uh, uh, heart. Those are no materiality, only mind. Because of this, uh, the mind in the Aruba realm, in material realm, uh, no arise based on base. So, uh, in this uh, chapter also, only you need to know and what is the uh, iron base, what is the uh, ear, nose, tongue, body base? Uh, that is uh, enough for future learning. <coughs> so
So next one. Next one is uh, Naipana, definition of Naipana. So uh, ultimate reality is, uh, uh, you may remember, uh, four kinds of ultimate reality. One is uh, Chaita. You have learned that Chaita is uh, 89 or 121. Chita, number two is uh, Chaitasika. Chaitasika is how many? 52. Yeah. Uh, number three is uh, Rupa. How many? 28. Number four is uh, Nibbana. So what is uh, Nibbana? Well, how uh, how define about the Nibbana? So Nibbana is a local Uttara, supramundane. Local Uttara is a Loka and Uttara, two words are combined. Loka, world. What is a world? Ubadanakanda, clinging aggregates. All the worlds, according to Brahmata view, Atimat view, clinging aggregates, which are objects of Asawa taints. Odara is uh, uh, Adika, another Pali, Sapas. So, Logodara means uh, surpassing the world. Because uh, Upadana Khanda are objects of Asawa. Nibbana is uh, not an object of Asawa. So, Nibbana is uh, surpassing the world. Uh, so, uh, in this case, uh, you may need to know as what taints. What is the taints? Taints is especially uh, ignorance, wrong view, uh, greed. These are taints. Why we call it taints? Why we call it as what? As what originally alcohol is as what? How to do alcohol? Uh, some materiality makes uh, keep, have to keep a long time. Data become alcohol like that. So, in the same way, in our body, ignorance, wrong view, and greed, those uh, uh, bad phenomena are long, time, long, long times ago in our body, uh, keeping long time. So, for us, uh, those are like uh, alcohol. <laughs> so, uh, this uh, also means awaja. Uh, uh, Ignorance, deity, wrong view, loba, greed. So, in the world, everything we can take uh, as an object with uh, those awaja, uh, greed, and wrong view. Something we see, uh, we don't know as a materiality, mentality. We know as a man, woman, like that, car, house. That is uh, the object of uh, awaja. Sometimes we want car, we want a house, so greed. Greed take uh, object, worldly things. Uh, so, but uh, Nibbana is a cannot take uh, like that. Cannot take uh, Nibbana as an object with a wager, wrong view, and uh, greed. So, if someone see Nibbana, uh, cannot have a greed beyond the greed. I want to get a nibbana too much, not possible, <laughs> like that. Uh, greed uh, desire are a bit different. Desire is uh, just uh, one, to, one to get. Like uh, in the scripture mentioned, uh, the archer want to shoot. At that time, uh, he take uh, the arrow. Uh, he take uh, the arrow to shoot only, not to hold, like that. Greed is uh, to hold. Uh, so, Nibbana is, uh, cannot, be, uh, cannot be object of the greed. So, beyond greed, or beyond ignorance, beyond wrong view. So, so that means a local data. So, next one, next Bali word says, Chetu Maga Nyane Na Sachi Kadaban. Nibbana is uh, to be realized uh, by the knowledge of the full path, the full mega. So, uh, when someone gets uh, mega knowledge, at that time can see Nibbana. Next one, Megaphalana Maramana. In the scripture mentioned like this, 
Nibbana is the object of Megha Pala. Megha is a father knowledge. Pala is a fruition knowledge. At that time we know. Uh, next one, uh, Dibacha from craving. Nibbana is a Nibbana. Vana is a craving, Ni is a Dibacha. So Nibbana is a Dibacha from craving. Usually Dibacha from every evil. But uh, uh, only important then say Dibacha from craving. So with the crave, uh, we can take an uh, object. We take, can take a uh, worldly thing as an object. But uh, we cannot take uh, Nibbana as an object with the craving. So, Nibbana, that mean is a Dibacha from craving. Next one is a three aspects. Saunyada, Animeda, Abnihita. Saunyada, void, void. Two meanings, emptiness of Raga, Dosa, Moha. Uh, in the Nibbana, no have Raga, no have Dosa, no have Moha. Emptiness in two ways, association and object, and object. So, uh, Nibbana is emptiness, raga, dosa, more. How to empty? Uh, two ways, association and uh, object. For example, uh, we give a Dhamma talk. Sometimes may associate, our mind may associate with the greed. For example, giving a Dhamma talk is a uh, some are to get a kusala, some are to be famous, for example, to get much, many gains. If so, even in giving in Dhamma talk, that is a can associate with uh, greed, like that. So, Nibbana is uh, once you get, uh, cannot associate uh, such a thing. So, for example, the food. The food we eat is, uh, we, by seeing the food, uh, we can take as an object with the greed. Some uh, food are not, not uh, healthy, but uh, we want to eat. That means uh, we associate the food with the greed. So the food uh, can associate with the greed. Uh, some uh, because of nutrient uh, we eat, that is uh, we not mean associating with the greed, craving. So Nibbana is, uh, you cannot get like that. Just uh, with the pure mind only, can take as an object. So that is a uh, cannot associate also uh, cannot do as an object. Raga uh, cannot take a neighbor as an object. Very different. And dosa cannot take a neighbor as an object. So neighbor and raga cannot associate or cannot associate as an object uh, mind like that. In this two way, uh, the emptiness of uh, raga uh, dosa moha. <coughs> uh, raga dosa moha. So next one is uh, being devoid of all sankara. Uh, emptiness of sankara. Sankara means uh, conditioned things. Conditioned things. Especially worldly things or worldly chaita chaita sika rupa. These are we call sankara, conditioned things, because of cause arise. Uh, so our body, our car, house, or all are because of condition arise. Uh, if you can do vipassana, all are arising and vanishing, arising and vanishing. This is a cause, this is an effect you can do. Nibbana is not like that, no arising and vanishing. Also, no cause. No cause. Uh, because of this, uh, Nibbana is uh, being devoid of all sankara. All sankara. Uh, so, next one is animated, signless. Being devoid of the signs of Raga, Dosa, Moha. Uh, no have the sign of Raga, the sign of Dosa the sign of moha in the nibbana. Being in the void of uh, signs of all kilesa, uh, all kilesa, no have a kilesa signs. Uh, so if you take uh, some object, uh, may have raga signs, oh, I want to get that, that is beautiful or like that. 
Nibbana, by seeing a Nibbana, uh, cannot take as a sign of Raga, uh, Dosa Moha. Next one is Abhinihita, desireless. Uh, here mean, desire means a law, but no desire of Raga, Dosa Moha, no desired by craving, too many, uh, too many. In the Nibbana, by seeing a Nibbana, cannot appear uh, within, within us, Raga dosa moha cannot appear within us. Next one is echuti, no chuti, deathless. Nirvana is deathless. All materiality, mentalities are in the worldly then uh, has to die always, rising and vanish. Nirvana is not like that. Uh, next one is echanda, uh, beyond the end, endless. For all conditioned things, Sankara, they have an end because they arise due to conditions. So when conditions cease, they also cease. But Nibbana is unconditioned. So it does not end with any conditions. Next one is Asankata, unconditioned, not formed by any cause, meaning no cause. Uh, an outera, not outera, nothing more superior than Nibbana, unsurpassed. Uh, Nibbana is the highest object, uh, the highest one. The Buddha also mentioned Nibbana Brahman Sukha. Nibbana is the most happiness, the most happiness. Uh, next one is uh, by its nature, Nibbana is the only one, peacefulness. But uh, by uh, distinction, two types of nibbana, sa ubadi se sa nibbana, sa together with ubadi aggregates, saha uh, se sa left over from the eradication of uh, defilements, nibbana together with the five aggregates uh, remaining without defilements. Uh, like that, uh, the Buddha uh, get a dynamite under the body tree. After that, uh, the Buddha teaches the Dharma. I got Nibbana. So the Buddha is not yet dying, but he said, I got Nibbana. That Nibbana means uh, he has uh, five aggregates, uh, result of previous karma, just a result, uh, but uh, no more kilesa, uh, no more kilesa, uh, no more defilements in his body. And that Nibbana is Saubadi uh, says, Nibbana. Uh, he's still alive, but he say, I got Nibbana. Uh, so next one is a new body says, uh, Nibbana. Nibbana without any aggregates uh, remaining after the Buddha passed away. So that Nibbana means no aggregates. So two kinds of Nibbana. Sometimes uh, in the scripture, use Kanda Bri Nibbana, Kilesa Bri Nibbana. Kile Sabri Nibbana is a ceasing defilements, ceasing of defilements, or cease of defilements. So under the body tree, the Buddha got attainment. All defilements are stopped. That is what we call Kile Sabri Nibbana. Kile Sa already died, but the Baza, the five aggregates, uh, result of previous karma still have. That Bri Nibbana means Kile Sabri Nibbana. But when the Buddha passed away, at that time we call Kandabri Nibbana. All aggregates are ceased. Yeah. <coughs> so, more definition according to Brahma Nimandana Sauta. Uh, Vijnana can be known. Or Nibbana is a can be known. Nibbana is that which can be known with the Mega Pala Pichawakana knowledge. Mega is a path, Pala is a fruition, Pichavakana is a reflection or reviewing. When uh, such a knowledge gets, we will see, we will know Nibbana directly. Uh, so because of this, uh, we call it Nibbana, Vinyana, like that. Next one is Anidasana, can't be seen. Anidasana is it can't be seen. What? 
with what? With the eye consciousness or naked eye? Huh? Naked eye. Cannot see with the naked eye, naked eye, like that. Uh, can't be seen. So when your eyes can be no, and it does not it can't be seen. <laughs> Can can be known and can't be seen. Huh? Uh, can be known is a with a special knowledge. Can be, can't be seen is a with the naked eye. So next one is ananda, no ends of uba, ubada, rising uh, vaya, perishing. Uh, ananda, not anda. Anda is the end, the boundary. All conditions things or worldly things has one end or boundary where they arise and another end where they perish. Because all things, for example, our life, rising in time have, perishing in time have. So in this side have reborn, in that side have died. So they have end. Nibbana is no have such end. So other mentality, materiality are one part are arising, the other part are perishing, have such end. For the nibbana, no have arising boundary, no have ending boundary. Because of this, nibbana is ananda. Next one is sabato baba, two definitions. No other dharma can be brighter or pure than nibbana. Sabado is completely, Baba is light. Nibbana has complete brightness, radiance. Nibbana is once someone sees Nibbana very bright, very bright, because of this uh, Sabado Baba. Uh, no other things uh, brighter than Nibbana. Brighter than Nibbana. Uh, next definition is uh, can attain to Nibbana from many ways. No, one way. Sabado is all directions. Baba is a river bank. So Nibbana has its bank in all directions. Can go into Nibbana in different ways. That means for one who wishes to enter into the river, he needs to enter through the river bank. Because Nibbana has its banks in all directions, so one who wishes to enter Nibbana may enter from any directions. It means one may attain Nibbana through any one of 38 or 40 uh, Samatha Kamatana, Tranquility Meditation. For example, meditation with the Kasina uh, way also you can go into the Nibbana. First of all, you practice Kasina, later go Vipassana can get or oh. asuba you can start from asuba meditation after that uh, practice uh, vipassana can go nibbana like that yeah you practice uh, anavana after that uh, you practice uh, vipassana can go to nibbana that means is uh, uh, many nibbana has uh, many uh, banks uh, in different directions and that is uh, the definition next one is uh, nanu buddha can be experienced by Sakaya deity, personality views. Uh, that word uh, the Buddha used uh, like that. Uh, one, one Brahma, very powerful Brahma, he's, he think uh, he know everything about the world. He know about the human, hair, Deva, Brahma, everything he know, he think. Uh, everything he know. So, he think uh, himself, uh, I'm the most one in the world. Uh, so, uh, like that. But when he meet the Buddha, uh, they like uh, do competition. So he asked to the Buddha, why I come here? How do you come here? Uh, he asked to the Buddha, the Buddha mentioned uh, what you have done. Uh, like that, uh, you, 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 your previous life say uh, what? what? How to practice the Buddha all mentioned. Uh, after I mentioned all, uh, the Brahma understand and the Buddha know like me. <laughs> so uh, at that time, the Buddha say another dance. Uh, 
something I know is uh, uh, cannot experience with all. With all you know, uh, cannot experience with all you know. Uh, so at that time, Brahma said, "Oh, you know something, but I cannot experience with all." <laughs> <laughs> if you know something, can know with something, uh, with something. Uh, so uh, you are uh, speaking is uh, not meaningful. Uh, this word is used. Uh, Nanu Buddha cannot experience. Sabadena uh, Nanu Buddha uh, cannot experience with all. I know something, cannot experience with all. Refer to Nirvana. With all means uh, for the Brahma. Brahma thinking is, uh, I know but we are the elements, I know what are elements, but Nibbana is uh, not like other elements, not like water element, not like fire element, not like uh, wind element, different from that, different from worldly things. He know about the human, Nibbana is uh, not like a human. He know about the Brahma, Nibbana is uh, not like uh, uh, about the Brahma. So, According to his knowledge, cannot know Nibbana. That means that I know something which you can, uh, I know something uh, which uh, can be known uh, with all. Uh, so at that time, he complained to the Buddha, oh, cannot know with all is, uh, that is uh, nothing. How oh, you know like that? The Buddha, that is, uh, I say, because for you only. For me, I can know with something uh, like that. So, uh, Nibbana is uh, like that, uh, can't be experienced by Sakaya deity, personality view, worldly view. With the worldly view, cannot, uh, cannot know Nibbana like that, beyond the worldly things. So, I heard uh, some story to mention about that uh, fish and turtle. Turtle is a uh, uh, go to the uh, go to the land. Uh, after coming back from the land into the water, he, he meet fishes. So at that time, the turtle say to the fish, "There is land." So at that time, fish uh, fish make questions. Land, you know, land is uh, you can swim into the land. Uh, no, cannot. <laughs> so. If so, can you see uh, each other uh, drawing through the land? Uh, cannot see. <laughs> because uh, fishes uh, only experience uh, he has uh, into the water. According to his uh, experience, always asking questions, uh, or uh, no, 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 have to answer for the, for the turtle, uh, like that. Uh, because uh, land is uh, different from Water. Uh, so uh, uh, that story is a uh, very good example uh, to know Nibbana. Nibbana is uh, beyond uh, worldly experience. Uh, worldly experience. So because of this, uh, uh, most of the world uh, we have craving, Nibbana no craving, like that. Uh, we have anger, Nibbana no anger. We have happiness, and Nibbana is uh, no have such a thing. So always, uh, always uh, no, 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 like that. <laughs> uh, so because of this, uh, some uh, uh, want to criticize uh, Buddhist, uh, Buddhism. Uh, Buddhism is a beginning point, is a can, can, can't be known, can't be known beginning points. So uh, uh, Buddhist view are, uh, like that, uh, they say, can't be known beginning, uh, start, uh, start not knowing, uh, start can't be known, or end nothing. <laughs> they, say, they say like that, uh, because of uh, that, that is uh, explained uh, in the scripture, those words uh, like that. So, uh, if you practice uh, vipassana, everything you can see, worldly things are rising and vanishing, or a small, small particle, even the mentality, materiality. Uh, so, Nibbana is, uh, uh, wherever you see, before that uh, you see like that uh, rising and vanish, 
You see house arising and vanish. You see yourself arising and vanish. You see other person arising and vanish. Uh, small, small particle. So after practicing a long time, uh, you see nibbana different from that. Uh, different from that is uh, no rising and vanishing. Very peace. Uh, uh, like a Savadopa, but you may see very bright. Uh, nothing brighter than Nibbana. Uh, nibbana. <coughs> but uh, that brightness uh, may have uh, some explanation. Uh, so I now have uh, about more definition books. May have uh, because uh, some teacher explained uh, Nibbana is uh, no gala, no brightness. Uh, so because of wisdom, wisdom produces the light. Uh, that uh, they say, but uh, I'm not sure about that. But uh, according to commentary's explanation, Nibbana is uh, bright, like uh, that. Maybe a possibility is, uh, for example, you have a torchlight to see something. But uh, light is a uh, have, although the object not have. Uh, so you may see only light. Actually, uh, light is uh, not object, you are torchlight. Possibility is uh, you see Nibbana is uh, only you are Western lights. Nibbana may not have a light. That is a possibility. But according to commentaries, explanations, Nibbana is bright. Because of your knowledge or because of that object is not sure. Anyway, at that time you will see very bright. So we finish uh, the, the fourth matri uh, the fourth ultimate reality. Now we will learn uh, mind process. <coughs> that is uh, uh, quite, I think, uh, I hope uh, you were interested in that. Uh, that is uh, uh, quite very practical to use. Uh, so, 22 rupa last for 70 mind moments. Uh, 17 mind moments or 51 self mind moments. Body and vocal intimation. Uh, two rupa, last for one mind moment, jadi, ubacaya, uh, production, sandadi, continuity, last for the first sub mind moments, out of 51, nejada, impermanence, last is, uh, for the last sub mind moments, out of 51, jarada, uh, agent, decay, last, for the middle 49 sub my moments. So uh, you may confuse a little, but only you need to know uh, the rubas are last 70 my moments. Uh, that is uh, quite enough. So, first of all, the five door process. Five door is uh, ein door, ear door, nose door, dang door, body door. These are five door. If you know ein door, you can do other doors. You can know other doors. So, we will show ein door process. Uh, Adiman Dharamana, Dharamana Wara, that is uh, the name of process. P, P is uh, uh, past Bowinga. <coughs> uh, so, like that, uh, uh, this is an eye, uh, this is an object, color object. Color object, if there is eye sensitivity, if there is a color object, if there is light, if there is attention. So if a three, a four factor complete, that process arise. What is a four factor? Eye sensitivity, color object, attention, and light. So this is a four causes. If there is a four causes, surely arise this process. Uh, nobody can stop or if there is a no this uh, four causes uh, one of them failed uh, if so nobody can create to have uh, such process uh, so uh, color object touch eye sensitivity at that time this uh, process arise so originally start uh, uh, from the sleeping <laughs> sleeping mind is a bowinga Sleeping is a bowinga. Uh, bowinga, that is a sleeping mind. 
between cognitive process, we are sleeping, always resting. Uh, now also we are sometimes resting. <laughs> because uh, sleeping in time is a very long time. That is what we call Bowenga mind, Bowenga function, the continuity of life. So after that, Kala uh, and uh, uh, insensitivity and binge at that time, still sleeping, because of sleeping, that is what we call past Bowenga. Past Bowenga. Past time, this is a one mind moment, one mind moment, this is a one mind moment. So in that time, touching the, the object touch our eye, now you wake up. One mind moment are sleeping. Although your eye is very good, although color object is very obvious, at least one, one Bowenga is uh, no you see at that time, no you wake up. So that is a past Bowenga. After that, uh, vibrating Bowenga. Vibrating is uh, Bowenga, the same type, uh, but uh, vibrating is because of Kala and Benji. You are, before Bowenga is uh, very stable, very quiet. Because a new object coming, vibrates, like a nearly wake up. Uh, next one is uh, A, arresting Bowenga. These are Bowenga uh, because of different, uh, different situation. We call it past Bowenga, vibrating Bowenga, and arresting Bowenga. Arresting is a stopping, stop, the last Bowenga. Uh, last. So you know you wake up, but three my moment already gone already gone. Uh, that is a very good, the best eye, or the best, the, the most obvious object. Uh, so these are Bowenga, Bowenga sleeping. So already, uh, mind is uh, already become three times. But uh, Kala, eye sensitivity is uh, still alive, because uh, these are materiality. These are mentality. Mentality is a uh, short life. Materiality is long, Life. So materiality, no, you die. Still have. After arresting Bowenga, Paido uh, advising consciousness. Pencha Dwara Wojana. Among 18 rootless chaita, Paido advising consciousness. Your mind advances towards new object. Before that, uh, these Bowengas are uh, object is a uh, Kama. Uh, object is uh, the object uh, in the previous life, near that the moment. Our sleeping mind is uh, no present object, uh, past object, past object. Uh, uh, in the previous life, in the near that the moment, we take one object. So our sleeping mind is uh, such an object. Uh, so, these are buddhis and uh, bowenga mind. Bowenga minds are resident consciousness because of this very quiet. Even oneself cannot know this chaita. So like that when you sleep, you cannot know I'm sleeping. Why? That is a resident consciousness. Uh, because of previous karma, uh, that mind appear. No reaction, just a resident. Uh, resident consciousness are like that, the picture into the mirror, in the mirror. Uh, the picture in, in the mirror is uh, no active. According to your action, has to be, has to be. Uh. So resident consciousness are like that, uh, no active. So because of this, uh, sleep like uh, sleeping. Now, Phaedo advising consciousness is, uh, that is, uh, advising is uh, one kind of function, you know? You have learned uh, functions, uh, 14 functions. Uh, among 14 functions, uh, a dividing function is one of uh, them. The mind uh, divides towards a new object. So that uh, Pido dividing consciousness uh, takes this new object, Kala object. Turn, just turning. No, you know uh, uh, other things. After Pido dividing consciousness, next one is I consciousness. Chaku Vainyana. Chaku Vainyana. Unconsciousness, what, what function it do? Seeing, seeing function. 
at that time see, you see color object. Uh, just the seeing, but no one know who and who, what and what. Just the seeing, uh, very early. So next one is uh, receiving consciousness. Uh, receiving consciousness is uh, some protection. You accept that object. Before you, you see something, later you accept. Just the accept. That is a receiving function, you know, among 14 functions. We have learned in a previous paper. Uh, so, next one is uh, investigating consciousness. Sandirana. Investigating consciousness. Investigating is like checking. You check that object. Oh, what, what kind of object come like that? That consciousness uh, check. Uh, invest. No, you decided. Uh, go on back. <laughs> like that. After that, uh, uh, determining consciousness. Determining is what uh, uh, Determining consciousness. Or mind or the body in the same. Mind or manodwara vachana is a two function it do. One is uh, mind or dividing consciousness. Dividing function. One is a turning function. So this is a uh, 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 one is a determining function. Now determining function. So determine is a decide, determined. Or that object is a good, or that object is a no good. According to your determination, hey, here will be Jawana, Jawana, seven times. Uh, seven times. Jawana is a kusala or akusala. For, the, for us, akusala, twelve akusala may have greed, may have anger, may have delusion, also may have kusala. Kusala is a maha kusala, eight, for us. So that is a very emotional stage, very high level of feeling. Uh, because of this, Jawana, because one consciousness arises seven times, like that you are running. Running is many step, have a power. Uh, only one step, but you cannot have a power. Because of one step, if you run, step many things, there's a power come out. In the same way, consciousness arises seven times, it's a, become, uh, has a much power. So that is a jawana function. In Bali, the, in, in, in English, they translate impulsion. But uh, what means, I don't know very well. But uh, jawana means uh, uh, have a power, some power, like a running power. Uh, one step of power, uh, many step of power is not the same. Uh, so that is a karma. Our in that time we produce a karma. If akusla, we will go to woeful states. If akusla, we will go to human and deva, like that. After seven times, uh, the dharma, the dharma is a vibhaka uh, uh, registration. Two times arise. That's the Vipaka mind is like a resultant consciousness, not powerful, very quiet. Uh, that is, a, uh, uh, you run before, but later want to stop. Uh, cannot stop suddenly. Uh, one or two steps uh, have to go. So in the same way, nearly stop. After that, Bhavanga come like that. So uh, the materiality, gala object, uh, eye sensitivity arise here. So. Mine is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So in that time, that materiality sees. The mind is a seventy time, seventeen time, but for the materiality, only one lifespan. So we measure the material. And the lifespan of materiality with the mind moment. So one materiality lasts 17 mind moments. So this color object and eye sensitivity sees here. Sees. C-E, huh? C-E, eh? I see, right? Sees, maybe stop. Stop. Uh, stop. In, in that time, like that. So that means it's a one materiality last 70 
my moment. So all these, uh, these uh, chaitas are take the color object. This uh, chaita also, color object, these are, all these are color object, except Bowenga. Bowenga is, uh, this Bowenga is a uh, uh, take object in the past life. After that uh, also Bowenga, uh, sleep again, sleep again. <coughs> uh, sleep again, like that. So, uh, we see something like that, uh, mind process arises like that, fight out of unconsciousness, seeing, receiving, investigating, determining. After that, uh, jona, 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 like, uh, like that. Uh, so, in that time, may not know very well, just to see something, but uh, no, don't know the name, don't know man or woman, like that. That is a later mind process, uh, continue. Mind or, but mind or consciousness arise. At that time, later we know that is a man or that is a woman. What is his name? Where the other mind process? So, mind process are just sees something only. No, you know other things. Uh, he has a term mind benefits, um, may not know. He has a term mind disadvantages, may not know like that just see something in that stage. So here is a change, changeable. If a color, this is a sound and ear, this is a ear consciousness. Ear consciousness. If this is a smell and nose, nose consciousness here. If this is a taste and tongue, tongue consciousness. If this is a tangible object and body, body consciousness. Here is a changeable. Other places are the same. So if so, I don't hear, don't know, don't know, don't know, body, do finish. Uh, some, so, like that. Hmm. Uh, so, according to object, these Bowengas are take the object in the past. From here, do there is a take this color object. Bowenga is a take the object in the past. That is about the object. About the mind, here, you know, Bowenga mind is a 19 chaita possibility. Among 90, only one. That is a need to choose, how to choose. <laughs> like that. So, uh, Fido Rvating is already only one, no problem. Uh, unconsciousness, here, these are uh, two consciousness. One of the two. Uh, receiving consciousness is a two. There is a two. Investigating how many? Three, yeah. Determining how many? Already one, no need to choose much. Uh, this is uh, uh, 12 Agusala also possible. Uh, eight Kama Ochra Kusala. Uh, eight Kama Ochra Kiriya. Uh, uh, eight Kama Ochra Kiriya. Uh, Eight Kama Ochara Kiriya. Twelve Agusla. Eight. Next one is a smile producing consciousness. One. Jawana. Smile. Twelve Agusla. Smile producing consciousness. Eight Kama Ochara Kusla. Eight. Eight Kama Ochara Kiriya. That is a Jawana. Jawana. So the Dharamna means the Dharamna is investigating consciousness three. Kama Ochra Vibhaka is 8 or 11. Uh, but one of them, but uh, two Chaita two cannot arise at the same time. But uh, we need to choose one of them. How to choose, have the way. Uh. <coughs> so, that is, uh, this Chaita uh, arise in the Aindo. You can check uh, this one. Uh, this uh, two is uh, three. Uh, five, uh, uh, eight. Oh, here is a ten. Oh, two, 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 two ten. So one, eleven, uh, eleven, thirteen, sixteen, seventeen, uh, seventeen. Here seventeen. Here is a uh, 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 thirteen, uh, thirteen, uh, twenty-one. Twenty-nine, 
Uh, so, Randina, here is uh, 11. Uh, so, uh, 16, 17, uh, 2, 4, 4, uh, 5. Huh? So, 50, 57 chaita. Uh, 57 chaita, that is uh, arising in the Aindo, but uh, these uh, three are uh, investigating in this, uh, investigating in the, uh, the same type, the same type, but uh, different function. Here, uh, that uh, consciousness is arising uh, by doing investigating function. Here is a registration function, different function, but uh, the same mind, the same mind, uh, yeah, different function, the same mind. Uh, Oh, uh, oh, that uh, that's uh, we call it. Uh, we we do this as a ten. That is a uh, not not only aindo, aindo iado nose do dang do. All all check that if we combine fifty seven. Uh, so uh, that is a uh, we we counting uh, uh, the do check that. But uh, anyway, uh, only we may need to know uh, briefly. For example. Uh, Bowinga mind is a 19, you know, 19 in Chaita uh, can be Bowinga. If so, one Chaita we need to choose, how to choose. Uh, so, what is uh, your Pati Sandi? Relinking consciousness. Bowinga mind is uh, the same as uh, you are relinking consciousness. Kama uh, Vachara Vipaka. So, uh, among 19, you are consciousness is a possibility is a uh, Kama Vachara Vipaka 8. Among Kama Vachara Vipaka 8. One of, uh, one of them. Next, uh, so Pai Do, no need to choose only one. But Ai uh, Iya knows the Dang body is uh, on two. Razado Gusla, uh, Razado Agusla. So if uh, the object is uh, good, you see something is uh, good, that is a uh, Razado Gusla, you should choose. If uh, you see something is uh, bad, that is a uh, Razado so you can choose one among two. Receiving consciousness also the same. One is a Rosado Kusala, one is a Rosado Akusala. According to object, you should choose. Uh, three, three also the same. Res what is an uh, object, good or bad? But a uh, good thing is a uh, true thing. One is uh, with a neutral feeling, one is uh, with a pleasant feeling. So, if uh, the object is uh, very good with the pleasant feeling, uh, normal good is, uh, is uh, with the neutral feeling. So here only one, no need to choose. Here is uh, many there, uh, we should choose. For, for example, if greed among eight, if anger two, if delusion two, if you do dana sila eight, for the arahanda, do dana sila this eight. If you smile, uh, if Aranda smile, this one possible. <laughs> so if you smile now, uh, this is uh, among that uh, with the pleasant feeling. Yeah, uh, our consciousness are uh, twelve agusala, uh, eight kama vachara kusala. That is a possibility. Uh, so. Uh, <coughs> So, uh, we say, in one mind moment, uh, there is uh, three sub-moments. So, this is a uh, one mind moment, but uh, we have a sub three sub-mind moments. One is uh, arising, one is uh, standing, one is uh, finishing or perishing. Uh, one mind moment is a three sub-mind moment. So, all are three, 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 seventy times is uh, fifty-one. So, for the Ruba, we say, Ruba last 70 my moment. Ruba last 51 sub my moment. That means, so Ruba is longer than uh, my moment. So we will read the next sentence. Seven Javana in general, six or seven times of Javana is normally uh, 
five times in the near death process. Uh, when we about to die, when we are about to die, only five times. Jawana is only five times, not seven times. Mostly, normally, seven times. Next one is during unconsciousness, unconscious time, with the very weak conscious. At that time, also only five times. Uh, that is about the about the rule of Jawana. Next one is uh, Mahanda Ramana. Mahanda Ramana is uh, the object is not so obvious. Color uh, object is not so obvious. Or another possibility is uh, your eye is not so good. If so, uh, uh, PP, 2P, 1P, one also passed, another one also passed. You know you wake up. <laughs> and that is a possible. The other things are uh, the same. If so, the, the last one is a shorter and shorter, like that. So, next one is a PPP, 3P, past, past, past. Uh, so, that is, a, if so, that object is a, we call a Mahandaramana. Mahandaramana is a, a, a deep Mahanda is a very big object. Mahanda is the only big object, not very big. Uh, next one is a Brahdaramana, very a little object, not obvious object or you are I is very poor. P, 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 four times. Fast, know you wake up like that. So, P, 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 five times like that. That is the only difference. So, we will jump. The next one is a deep breakdown. I'm now. Oh, many P. Huh? Many P. P, 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 P. After that, vibrating. Huh? Vibrating, vibrating. Vibrating, vibrating. No, uh, five door advancing. After vibrating, sleep again. <laughs> yeah, just shaking. Eh? Because the object in bench, uh, you or I, uh, because the object is very soft. So just vibrating, like disturbing. You don't see anything. After vibrating, it becomes bowinga, like that. Uh, so, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, sleeping also, now also, some object will impinge you. For example, in front of you are many objects. Uh, many objects, uh, sometimes uh, this uh, picture object may not impinge you. Uh, because of this, uh, sometimes you go back, uh, other person may, may ask you, uh, there, is there any false arrows picture you see? I don't see. <laughs> I don't see, although in front of you. Uh, like that, because uh, your attention is uh, not enough, uh, not enough. Awakening in time also, actually uh, that picture is uh, always impinging in you, <laughs> impinging in you, but uh, you don't pay attention. You pay attention to other things, although you go back, I don't see anything. Maybe sometimes it's just vibrating, <laughs> like that. Uh, you pay attention to other things. Uh, all those small, small objects are always may impinge you. Because of you are I'm poor or because of color very small, also you pay attention very little, uh, anything possible, like that. Mm. So now next one we will learn, causes of I'm consciousness. Uh, I'm consciousness or I'm process. I'm sensitivity, color object, light, and tension. This is a four causes uh, to arise uh, that process. If there is a four causes uh, complete, uh, surely arise. Nobody can stop not to arise. If uh, one of them fail, uh, cannot have uh, this process. For example, you have I, and the picture have. Uh, if you don't pay attention, you pay attention to other things, uh, cannot arise, cannot see picture, uh, like that. Uh, so, uh, next one is uh, causes of ear consciousness, ear sensitivity, sound object, space, uh, attention, attention. Uh, the same only differences as uh, space and light. Next one is uh, nose sensitivity, smell object, wind element, attention, wind element only. Uh, next one is uh, causes of dung. 
consciousness, tongue sensitivity, taste objects, water element, attention. Water, if you are, you are tongue is very dry, cannot get a taste. Next one is the causes of body consciousness, body sensitivity, tangible object, other element. Some of them uh, need to hard to touch, attention. So next one is about the jawana. If there is a yoni so manasikara, proper attention, kusala jawana arise. Oh, that is a rule. Rule is, uh, if there is a yoni so manasikara, you have uh, this jawana is a kusala jawana. Can be. That is a uh, you need to practice uh, kusala jawana. If a uh, uh, proper attention you have, yoni so manasikara is a proper attention or wise attention. If ayoni so manasikara, improper attention, akusala jawana arise. For example, by seeing someone, if you touch loba arise. If you radiate a meta, eight kamo charakusala arise. Like that. Uh, even if you see Buddha, uh, most of the Buddhists get kusala. But for the Devadatta, want to fight. <laughs> so dosa. Uh, object is the same, but attention is a difference. So, uh, if uh, there is a proper attention, kusala jawana, you should choose uh, you will arise. If uh, improper attention, kusala jawana will arise. Uh, like that. So, by seeing something, uh, you can, uh, you may have uh, attention, some attention. Uh, so, here there are many flowers, you see, offered to the Buddha. Uh, you can think, oh, they have a faith, a very good sadhu sadhu. If so, you get a kusala. No. How they waste money too much? <laughs> uh, can, can do like that. Uh, so if so, may arise uh, anger. Anger may arise. So uh, many things possible. Many things possible. <coughs> So about the mind door process, uh, uh, about the five door, we know causes. About the mind door process, uh, uh, we need what kind of object appear in mind. That is also a bit important. But uh, some people, because uh, some people are sometimes, they see what and what in mind. When they meditate, uh, what kind of object appear, why they want to ask. So what kind of object can appear? One is experience. Uh, experience is uh, you have seen, you have heard, uh, you have met, like that. What well, well, one heart? You have heard something. Uh, next one is related to both, uh, one and two. Uh, not directly, relation, have a relationship. So according to your experience, according to your, uh, what you heard, uh, later other than you can think other than you can think. Uh, not directly. Because of this, uh, even in ghost, uh, what, uh, Western uh, see ghost, uh, Asian people see ghost is a uh, difference. Uh, <laughs> have a difference. <laughs> like that. Because uh, we have Asian thinking, Western uh, is a uh, Western thinking. Huh? And their ghost is uh, different from our ghost. <laughs> <laughs> like that. So related to our experience, uh, related to what uh, one had. Next one is believing. Uh, not really have because of believing appear in mind. Some object appear in mind. So the, some devas uh, gods may have, may not have, but if they believe, uh, may appear in their mind because of believing. So. What one likes or dislikes? Uh, if someone likes very much or dislikes too much, may be in mind. May be in mind. Uh, <coughs> uh, so sometimes uh, uh, that is uh, may happen uh, in our mind, especially in the dreams. Huh? Someone like uh, you like too much, but uh, because of something cannot do but uh, in, in a dream appear. <laughs> Dislikes are also possible. Eh? Dislikes are possible. So 
some housewives are in the, they say, some people say, in the dream, uh, mostly they dream uh, very uh, important guests are coming, but uh, nothing to cook. <laughs> so in the same way, uh, for the teachers, uh, someone teach or something, uh, uh, students are come, but uh, no yet see the scripture to teach. <laughs> so such dreams are, uh, may happen again and again. Uh, we don't like uh, such a situation. Uh, we fear that because of this uh, appear in mind. Next one is uh, thinking. You think something very deeply. Uh, uh, so because of this, uh, some object may appear. Delight by deciding or thinking with the wisdom. Uh, that is uh, with the wisdom uh, you think. Uh, you know uh, accurately. And that is uh, with the wisdom. Due to the power of karma, Sometimes because of karma appear, especially in the near-death moment. Near-death moment, uh, objects are com come uh, in the past uh, because of power of karma. Uh, if someone has done a lot of Agusla, uh, Agusla object uh, will come. Uh, so like that, that is a power of karma. So due to the imbalance of elements, such as plum, blood, where wind binds. That is according to Asian India. So anyway, if there is a, a, any imbalance in our body, like a very fever at that time, very strange object come out because the body is not balancing. Next one is due to the power of Dewas. Uh, Dewas. Dewas show you some object can do. Uh, may right, may correct, may not correct. Uh, may not correct is uh, some one bandy maybe he trying to cut uh, bigger trees. Uh, the dewa, tree dewa doesn't like that bandy. Uh, so at that time, first of all, he, the dewa show correct object. So uh, because of uh, saying Ali, people uh, like uh, that big uh, also very famous. Oh, he dreams something is very, uh, he, he says something is very correct. So later the day was show very big event in the country where happen problem, some problem like that. So the whole country are very fear, even can uh, hear about that uh, from the bandit. But uh, they were at that time telling lie. So later can become angry when you say very fearful things for the country. So the king killed Bandi, like that. That is uh, shown by Dewa. So may correct, may not correct. But anyway, they can show object. So the next one is uh, knowing according to two kinds of knowledge. A new world understanding according to the four noble truths, but uh, not penetratable. Uh, that uh, is, uh, you brightest uh, four noble truths, uh, you see materiality like a small pieces, uh, Nature Doka Nata can see. Uh, that is according to uh, Nuboda Jnana. So n later you may see Nibbana. So to see Nibbana, the Buddha not teach uh, to see directly Nibbana, to look at, uh, to find out Nibbana. Only need to discern body, uh, materiality, mentality. If enough, we see Nibbana automatically, penetratively, without doing anything to see Nibbana. So, that knowledge is, we say, penetrative knowledge. You trying to focus uh, materiality, mentality, nature, dukkha, nada only. You are not trying to focus on nibbana. But if enough, we we'll see. Because of this, uh, sometimes the Buddha say, to find out nibbana, need to see in the body. Actually, nibbana is uh, not in the body, outside of the body. But uh, to find out nibbana is uh, need to discern the body only. No need to find out outside. Later when no automatically, penetratively. And that is a uh, penetrative knowledge may appear in your mind. <coughs> so that is, a, these are the objects of uh, mind or process. So if something appear in your mind, you can check this. Uh, you can check this. But another one left, uh, some scripture mentioned, uh, 
Bhagavanimeta. Bhagavanimeta is the sign of future, future events. Uh, some people uh, can know earlier than future events. Can know. So mostly those people uh, always uh, they recite a Buddha's quality or some dhamma. Uh, especially recite a Buddha's quality, break the chanting, always do. If so, they can see before events. Uh, so uh, maybe that is uh, sometimes shown by Deva or maybe because of power or karma, possible, can see uh, earlier than have been. <coughs> so uh, that is uh, mentioned in another scripture. So according to time, uh, we should stop. Huh? If there is any question, you can ask. Oh yes, uh, according to base, uh, five or five unconsciousness is into the heart. Unconsciousness only into the e, into the eye. Only this one, only into the eye. And uh, this uh, jada, this uh, jada, this uh, all, all are into the heart. So only that, uh, this uh, only into the eye. The other jadas are into the heart. So if ear uh, consciousness, ear uh, heart. If nose consciousness, nose and heart, like that. Yeah. We are, uh, no, first of all, five dot wording here. Bowenga also here, five dot wording also here. Uh, unconsciousness is here. So if you want to descend in the Vipassana stage, you have to hold three things. One is a heart base, one is a eye base, the other one is a color object. Hold these three things. Always uh, you should try to embange these three things. So whenever you embange these three things, this process comes up. So you can discern uh, mentality. At that time, because of knowledge, you can hold three things. Like a fire, you know, from here, here, and the object. For example, you see a Buddha image, that is an object, or I or heart. You should see together. Together. So whenever you binge this process the same time uh, can hold. Yeah. Can hold. Yeah, yeah. The object together. So at that time you can see the process. The objects they are seeing in the mind. Our past life mm. Uh, uh, re uh, <coughs> the object in the past uh, that is uh, may appear, may be, uh, uh, may be, uh, may not appear. Sometimes I forget. Uh, some very obvious events may appear, may appear. But uh, for the human, you know, we have stayed in the mother womb ten months, quite long time from young have to start. So, uh, possible to forget. Very much possible to forget. But uh, some people can know. They have uh, Jadaisra knowledge. Jadaisra is uh, can remember previous life. One life, two life, three life, possible. So they can remember. Uh, some people, are, uh, most of people uh, cannot remember. But uh, anyway, uh, we have uh, some, we may have some effect, uh, may be, uh, yes, that is impossible. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Bhante, just check. Just now you mentioned about Bhavanga. Is it taking the past life object or past object? Uh, past life object is it in the near at the moment of the past life, uh, we take uh, one object to produce uh, this life. Uh, this life, that object. That object is uh, a long time ago also possible. Not only in the previous life, 
but mostly in the previous life object. For example, like that, in this life, you do many kusla also. You may do many kusla also you have done. So in the near death moment, one of object may appear. If it appears, for example, this object, you are like that, uh, see this Buddha, this people, or this Bande, after that you die. If so, you die with the Kusala my moment. So you are pretty sandy in the future life, but when God sleeping mind, uh, take this object. So because you're confused, because you say Bawanga take the same object yeah. throughout all life. Yeah. So you'll be the same object throughout the life? Or? Yeah, the same object throughout the life until we die. So whenever we sleep, the same object. The same object. Is yeah. it possible that you know what object we, we can't see with our uh, wisdom eye? Yeah, yeah. We cannot see that object normally uh, without bright zinc. Because of that is Bhavanga mind is a resident consciousness. Bhavanga 19 is, a, you know, Kamauchara Vipaka, resident. Rupauchara uh, Vipaka, like that, or a resident. Resident mind is a resident of previous karma. So uh, in the scripture mentioned the picture of in the mirror. The picture of in the mirror is according to you, Asian, has to be a, itself is a, Another, another active. Uh, so, very quiet. Very quiet is uh, only you, you, if you sleep, like uh, you are very rest, no, no need to use uh, your energy. The mind is a uh, very resting time, very quiet. Even ourselves, uh, we cannot know. Uh, we are sleeping. So, uh, such a weakness. Uh, uh, such a uh, very subtle mind is uh, we cannot know. Uh, we cannot know ourselves. So to know that object, uh, how we should practice. In the Vipassana time, after descending mentality, materiality, internally, externally, we have to go back. We have to go back uh, in, the, in the past life. So like that uh, yesterday, mentality, materiality, uh, previous 10 years, 30 years, 40 years, 50 years, go into the mother womb. At that time, you can see, because of knowledge. After mother womb, you cross duty, death, death, the mind moment. Before death, the mind moment, I have seven jawana. At that time, it's a jawana, you know, uh, five jawana. Jawana is a quite active, obvious. So instead of this sleeping mind, to go to there is more obvious the same type. So at that time you can see your karma, what you have done. If so, you will see that object. Uh, if so, at that time you will understand uh, our sleeping mind is that object, uh, uh, like that. Because uh, although this is a, that is a far, that is a uh, active mind, kusala mind, kusala mind. So our Bohinga is the same as that Jawana. That Jawana. This is a result, that is a cause. Cause is a very active, can produce a result. Uh, awaken, like that. So you do Gusala now, very obvious, you can see everything. You can hear the sound, you know. But uh, because of this karma, you will get the next life. If so, you are sleeping in mind, is this object the same? but uh, very quiet, uh, very quiet. Uh, that's, those minds are support each other very quietly. In Bhattana, we call uh, it uh, Vipaka Pachyo. Vipaka Pachyo is uh, support very quietly in our body. Yeah, uh, like that. <laughs> yeah. Is there karma performed at the uh, uh, Chakudora Viti? 
Kama is a Kama is the only Jawana stage. So that is Kama because yeah, yeah. that it will be followed by Mano Dwara Viti. So yeah, later Mano Dwara Viti we have we have. Mano Dwara Viti is a, after seeing something, uh, that is a present object. Uh, Mano Dwara Viti is a no no present object. I get that mind all the body and consciousness, Jawana Jawana seven times. Like that. That is followed by Mano Dwara Viti. Object is the same, but past. In that time, present, for this mind time, already past, because uh, Kala already died there, 70 mind moments. After a few bowing this mind process arises. Uh, the same object, this mind process, uh, the same Kala object, but it is past, uh, like that. After also, uh, another mind process uh, will come. Will come is a uh, 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 what is that? Maybe, oh, that is a human, you see. At that time, you will know oh, it's a human. Later, mind process may come. At that time, oh, his name is a what? Like that. So many mind processes are working in our body by seeing something. By seeing something. Uh, we are thinking it's uh, just to see and uh, see, look at and uh, see. But uh, in the mind, very busy. Like a computer, you, you press uh, one, one button, but the computer is working very well inside, like that. In the same way, you see something is very complicated uh, in a bit of my way. So many thinking, sometimes we are thinking, where well, I meet this one, how much friendly I have stayed. <laughs> I forget a person, also name, <laughs> like that. So later thinking, thinking, walking, walking, later we know name, uh, we have a speech, each other, what kind of speaking, like that. That is many mind process uh, come again and again, uh, like that. So, karma is a jhana time, only karma, very emotional stage. Uh, that is uh, karma. The, the, uh, these are not karma. These are mostly, five dot parting is a kiriya chaita. Receiving unconsciousness is a vipaka. Receiving also vipaka resultants. Investigating also vipaka resultants. That is a kiriya. And that's a no kusala, a kusala. Jawana time, a kusala, a kusala. Or even uh, at the first moment of the um, idol process, yeah. karma already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. But uh, uh, although we say karma already um, may, uh, may weak very much because of past seeing, later thinking only, especially in the mind only. Uh, quite powerful. Aindo is uh, not powerful, Aindo, Iado. Just uh, see, just uh, e, here is uh, not much a problem because of later thinking only. <laughs> uh, someone speak uh, you badly, just uh, here no problem if you don't know m much meaning. But uh, after knowing uh, meaningfully, uh, so at that time uh, anger come out something like that. <laughs> like that. So, uh, I'm process, ear process is uh, not powerful. Mind or only uh, much powerful. Yeah. But the Bhavanga is 19 consciousness, right? Uh, yes. But this 19 also can associate with mental factor, right? Yes. So it's more than 19. Oh, uh, uh, yes, 90 is uh, that is a. Uh, Chaita, a kind of chaita. So uh, no, no mean chaitasika. Chaitasika is an uh, association of chaita. So it's just 19? Yeah, 90 is a chaita. Uh, surely among, among 90, one of them, in each, in each associated with a few mental factors. Mental factors. For example, our mind is uh, among 90, our consciousness is a possibility is uh, 8 Kama Vachara Vipaka. Uh, 8 is uh, like that, some are associated with the pleasant feeling, some are associated with the neutral feeling, some are with the wisdom, some are without wisdom. Uh, so, like that. Among 8, you have to choose one. That is a Chaita. What is a Chaita? Chaita is awareness of the object. Associating mental factor is, uh, for example, 7. Universal Chitasika, Pasa Virana, Sinya, Chitana, Ekaka, Dajivit, Indariya, Munasikara. Uh, 
these are the same. Uh, after that, uh, uh, six, six occasions uh, may have. After that, uh, 19 beautiful jada may have. After that, uh, uh, wisdom may have, or may not have. Like that. So in each jada, that is a jada. Jada is uh, among eight, or may say among 19. One of jada. This jada is only among 19. This jada zika is always. Always. Some chaita sika only may have, may not have, for example, wisdom. Wisdom, our bodhisandhi uh, may associate with the wisdom, may not associate with the wisdom. That is, uh, may have differences, but uh, this seven are surely the same, like that. What, what do you want to say? So, for uh, meditation, yeah. So, is it? For some people, it's difficult to meditate because our bhavanga mm. is, uh, we don't feel at rest in meditation. We have to put effort. When we come out of meditation, we feel, we feel tired. Yeah. Even though we have a good meditation, mm. maybe because, it's, is it because the bhavanga is, we have, it's not our bhavanga, it's a different, we are str trying to get another consciousness which is not, com we are not comfortable with. Uh, bhavanga is, uh, we usually we say, our body and relinking consciousness. Relinking consciousness is uh, if associated with the wisdom. Uh, that is a knowledgeable person. Starting in point of our consciousness. So people who have bhavanga with wisdom, the uh. meditation improve very fast. Uh, possible, possible generally. But uh, they also uh, have uh, some causes. For example, even bodhisattva. Bodhisattva is uh, have to practice six years to get attainment. Bodhisattva is uh, the most knowledgeable. Why he has to practice six years? Because of his karma. He, he has said, uh, another Buddha, if uh, I will be Buddha, uh, uh, forget about six days, uh, can practice six years uh, like that. Because of that karma, he has to last six years. So you may say, uh, Buddha is also very difficult to practice. <laughs> uh, that is not because of knowledge, because of karma. Some people are because of knowledge, some people are because of karma. Because of karma. So we cannot know uh, because of knowledge or because of karma. Uh, like that. But uh, if we believe ourselves, uh, because of some other things, uh, we can think very sharply. Uh, if so, oh, maybe I has a knowledge, maybe some way is uh, something is wrong. Uh, if not, improve. Uh, so many, many reasons. Uh, the weather you stay, maybe suitable, may not suitable. If it's suitable, that is uh, more easy. If not suitable, uh, uh, if not, it should be not easy. If it should be more easy. So you have to eat uh, food in the meditation center. The food is uh, should be for you. If so, you will improve uh, fastly. Uh, like that. Uh, many things, your association, your teacher, your environment, food. And so those are also causes. So cannot say only because of knowledge. Even Buddha uh, quite last to improve <laughs> six years. Uh, so some bandages are also like that. Some are very easy, some are quite long time. According to uh, their karma, other causes also have. Yeah. But if uh, someone, uh, Bohinga, not associated with the wisdom, that person cannot improve until jhana. That is the shuwali. But uh, that is, uh, although she was not so much useful, just uh, understanding. So much, not so much useful as uh, we cannot know before improvement. <laughs> only when we get a jhana, only at that time we can know ourselves. Oh, I am, uh, my boinga is associated with the wisdom. <laughs> before that, uh, we, although not improve, uh, we cannot know. Uh, because of wisdom or because of other causes, uh, we don't know. So, like that, uh, uh, 
But I as uh, you, you forget about that is better. Just uh, trying to improve. Yeah. Uh, Bhante, the Chitta Vitti is 17 mind moments. Mm. And if now I look at Bhante for, say, two seconds, huh? it's about a few hundred million Chitta Vittis uh. in series. Uh. So, Bhante, may I know that the, how, how these 200 millions are joined together? Is it 17 by 17 by 17? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So interrupting by Bowenga. Bowenga. No, no. Cannot rise. Uh, cognitive mind is. Uh, Cannot rise uh, more than seventeen. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, interrupting in Bowenga, interrupting in Bowenga only. Yes. Yeah. Huh? Uh, why? Like that uh, for the fish, uh, if there is uh, no water, <laughs> how to say? It? Land is uh, how to say? Huh? For the turtle, <laughs> like that. Uh, Nirvana is uh, uh, only uh, because uh, we know mentality, materiality only. That is uh, our, our range. Nirvana is uh, beyond our range. So only has to say, you know only mentality, materiality. Uh, Nirvana is uh, no mentality, materiality only. <laughs> uh, we cannot say other things. Yeah, yeah no more consciousness and uh, no more materiality. Cessation of uh, mentality, materiality. In other words, uh, cessation of uh, suffering. Yeah, suffering. So you may fear the worry, uh, uh, oldness, uh, sickness, uh, death. Uh, so never no, no have such a thing. <laughs> Only has to say no, no, no. <laughs> no, no, something you know. <laughs> like that. So that means Nanu uh, Buddha, Savadena, Nanu Buddha uh, cannot experience uh, with all. Something the Buddha says, something I know is yes, uh, cannot experience uh, with all, uh, like that. Because uh, according to our range, always uh, we want to make a question uh, Is there a man in the Nibbana? Is there a woman in the Nibbana? <laughs> we ask. So every question is. Uh, uh, we may say no, <laughs> like that. Uh, but a little bit, if you can practice uh, vipassana, uh, vipassana uh, ben niya, because uh, at that time you, what, wherever you see, whatever you see, becomes small, more, small more pieces, rising and vanish. So nirvana is uh, free from that, no have such a rising and vanish, uh, like that. Yeah. And Niroda Samabhati is like that uh, stop mind. Mind stop. Uh, Chaita stop, Chaita Sika also stop. Uh, Chaita Charuba, mind bone materiality, stop. But uh, what still have is a uh, temperature bone materiality, have. Kama bone materiality, have. Uh, nutrient bone materiality, still have. Uh, not only the bo even the body still have this body still have body is uh, made of uh, made of temperature made of food but uh, no consciousness you not take any object you don't know anything just uh, um, sleeping is uh, still taking object but uh, that is uh, no totally no mind also no mind bone materiality mind bone materiality is uh, like that we shake here and there, that is a mind bone materiality. Uh, as seven days, uh, because of food, because of, that is a fourth. Huh? After seven days, like that, uh, Niroda Samabhati is uh, for the Nagami, for the Arhanda Pasa. So, when they do seven days, is uh, if they do more than seven days, their nutriment uh, will stop. After get up, we die. But within, uh, within uh, seven days, they cannot die. 
they cannot die. After get up, they will die. So what is the benefit? If he is a Nagami Pasa, he cannot practice to be Arahanta. That is one, one reason. Another thing is if he is Arahanta, he no have a chance to give admonishment for the fellow monks. Uh, usually after uh, near to die, about to die, they teach Dharma for the fellow monks. Because at that time he is near to die. Although people know he is Arhanda, no problem. He will go away. <laughs> like that. Before, earlier than before, is, uh, if people know, you know, everybody will approach him. <laughs> like that. So he got a property also. Uh, um, you may think Arhanda have a desire to, to get a lot of gains. Uh, if so, you will get Agusla. So usually, if they near to die, they teach Dharma. In the world, there is Arahanda. I will show you like that. I will teach you. They want to teach before death. So if they do more than seven days, they may not have to improve their Dharma or to give Dharma. So that is their aim. So for the Brahmas, may do more than seven days. Brahmas, they was. <clears throat> I'm very curious to know those who uh, attain psychic power would they be able to see their previous life? Yes, surely she can. And if there's a case, they won't be putting so much effort to do the practicing, right? So much? So much effort to do the practicing of this, the, the, the five door or this, that what you are mentioning just uh, now. Uh, to see previous lives uh, uh, out of the Buddha's dispensation also have. These teachings are uh, within the Buddha's dispensation, uh, can practice. Uh, that is uh, may, more related to Vipassana. So to get uh, such a psychic power, is only need to get a jhana, need to practice uh, uh, eight kinds of kasina. Eight kinds of kasina, many ways they, they do from beginning to the end, from the end to the beginning, jumping or something like that, uh, they have to do a kananga. They have to tame mind uh, until a very powerful. After that, uh, they are trying to see past life. So they can see many lives, uh, about 40 eons. Uh, 40 eons uh, they can remember. That is outside of the Buddha's dispensation, uh, at most. But within the Buddha's dispensation, because of practicing vipassana, such a thing, they can see more than 14 eon, uh, about uh, maybe, I think, uh, uh, one million like that, or 100,000 eon, they can see. Uh, that is a normal disciple of the Buddha. If a great disciple, uh, more than that, if a chief disciple, more, many eons, for the Buddha, no limit. For the Buddha, no limit. So, if a practice this, then more knowledgeable. Outside of the Buddha's dispensation, no practice this totally, but still they can see if at most 40 eons. At most, yeah. Uh, okay, sharing merit. Uh, repeat after me. Idame nyati na hodu Suki da hundu nyadeyo Idame ponya Asawakaya Wahan hodu Idame ponya Nebanasa Bachayo Hodu Mama Bonya Bagan Saba Sadana Bajemi Tesabe Mesama Bonya Bagan Labandu Sadu 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 Thank you.